Hey guys, welcome to Robin Hood Sherwood Builders. This is the free little version of the game called Bandit's Trail. We're going to test it out and see how it is. Robin of Loxley survived the burning suns of faraway lands as he served his role in the Unforgiving Crusades. He emerged unscathed from deadly skirmishes just to become an exile and face mightier enemies in his own home country. After his previous hideout in Silwich, which was razed to the ground, the forests of Sherwood granted refuge to him and his retinue, while its new rulers threatened all. King Richard the Lionheart's untimely demise plunged England into chaos and left roving bands and their petty warlords free to fight amongst themselves for territory and influence. The Sheriff of Nottingham, a murderer and usurper, exploiting the pervasive lawlessness, pillages one area after another, increasing his power and leaving the poor residents of Sherwood at the mercy of wild fate. Whoa. That was cool. Wow, this is beautiful. Look at that movement. I don't know how much content is available in this little free demo version, but damn, this is beautiful. Look at this guy. A safe home. Speak to Tuck. What's Hunter's vision? Oh my god. And this is free. Oh my god, that's so cool. <laughs> Lantern. Wow. This is amazing. And I just freaking logged into it. Let's stand right here. Oh. Free movement while attacking. No enemy target. Select. Oh, combat mode. Okay. Precise. Lock movement while attacking. Enemy targeting. Oh man. I don't know which one I should do. You can always change the combat mode in the set. Okay, I want to do free free movement. I'll do free movement. If we feel like we need a, we're getting like, it hand it to us. You know, <laughs> we're getting bent over. We'll switch to the precise mode. But let's do dynamic. Uh, difficulty. Uh, we'll go rogue. Just so we can explore stuff. I'm testing out stuff. Look at that running through there. It's so s smooth. Listen to that water. Wow. Where's Tuck? Oh, he's over here. Oh, my horse! I got a horse! Oh, hell yeah. Oh, man, I'm already lost. I can tell this game's gonna get me just... Oh! Roma's main goal is to liberate the four regions in central England from the rule of the Sheriff of Nottingham and his followers, eliminating enemies and aiding the defenseless um, through quests and events increases Robin's reputation in the given region. Alright. Uh, achieving a score of 40% reputation in a region unlocks the ability to start in main story quest, whose successful conclusion ultimately liberates the region. Uh, while exploring the region, you will encounter events and quests that will bring you closer to completing your adventure's main goal. Some of these will include... Oh, do I hit him? Oh, I'll, I'll hit him for that. Saving villages, residents from execution, escorting them and rescuing them from kidnappers, attacking convoys, warehouses, and tax collectors, um, defending people against corrupt knights, ruthless soldiers, forest raiders, and many other threats. Oh my god, this is in depth. Your character development will depend on the effective use of skill points and expansion of your own settlement, allowing you to craft the necessary items, gain special abilities, or produce the necessary raw materials oh my god I love the Robin Hood story Ooh. oh I accidentally hit F <laughs> uh -huh, food and hydration remember to regularly check your indicators of hunger and thirst if you neglect either of these conditions it has lethal consequences uh, simple food items can be found in the world or bought at traders, you can construct a kitchen in Robin's Village that will enable the preparation of much fancier meals. Water is a far simpler matter. Luckily, you need to find a well and have the required empty bottles or on you. Do not be fooled though. Bottles are significant items that need to be managed well. They can determine the success of a mission more than once. 
Huh. Do I have the necessary? I do. Empty bottle. Oh, craft. Sweet. How's my everything's up right now? Oh, that's not too bad. That's pretty sick. Let's go talk to Tuck. Grab these. We never know what we might need to craft with these, so I'll just grab some right now. What is this? Salt. What's up, Tuck? Oh, Friar Tuck! I always worry when you're away from home for long, Robin. My good Friar, the Sheriff will face death. My good Friar, the Sheriff will face death well before I do. Haughty as always, I'm just glad to see you in good health, friend. Don't worry. We're not in danger this time. We're safe here. Nothing I can do after the nightmare that the Crown's men brought on us and our old home. This time they won't run into us. We're well hidden. I saw to that. The previous settlement was so goodly. I know you all too well, you crafty fox. I'm aware you're scheming to fight back. What matters is everyone made it out alive. After I defeated Black Henry and freed Marion, the sheriff completely lost his composure. I must stop the enemy before he becomes too powerful. The enemies, the king and sheriff, don't stop at their own henchmen. You constantly hear about ever more scoundrels plaguing the surroundings of Nottingham. King's allies grow in numbers. Some are bought with land assignment, others threatened with death and confiscations. We must weaken the grip of the king and the sheriff if we are to feel safe here. Definitely, Robin. Recently, little John had his shirt cut. We can't take risks like that. He'll recover. You know him. We each have our crosses to bear. You say so yourself. Well said. You may be right. This settlement seems secure. This time no one will find us. Time to let an arrow loose right into the beast's heart. I believe you, dear Robin, but before you do that, you must regain your strength. Setting up a new village is exhausting work. Eat something, have a drink, rest in your home. We'll talk later. Uh, this is what your inventory looks like. You can find all of your equipment in it. You can access it at any time. Hold tab to access it during the game. You can also use the hotbar items by pressing the relevant key number. Your backpack has a limited capacity. Okay, so we do have weight. Uh, sometimes, of course, your travels, you may find yourself in possession of special items. These are typically related to quests. They weigh nothing and take up no space in your inventory. Oh, that's sick. Dude, I love this. Without protection, the forest of Sherwood. Okay, so we could build our house. We got armor. And items you no longer want in your inventory, you can be discarded on the ground. Remember, however, that they will most likely disappear. Okay. All right. Where's my house? What's this? Oh, is this a dog? A sheep? Can I climb this? I guess not. Oh, eat. Eat and drink water. So, okay, let's... Um, eat, and then I'll put some water there. Oh, you know what? Let's um, move this here, move that there, move that there. And tab. Get some food in us. Look at that, dude. That's a mighty bottle. Alright. Go sleep in your home and then speak to Flyer Tuck. Alright. Let's go two. Drop that. I want to see my sword. Look at that. I'll see if it moves like a certain way. That's pretty sick. Okay. Uh, where's my home? Right here? Oh. Oh, that's cool. Oh, okay. So there's different missions. Oh, wow. No, oh, I like that. Alright, we'll go sleep real fast. And then, um, we'll do a quest or a mission. Antidote. So we got some more food items in there. Already. It's like daytime and he wants me to sleep. <laughs> Sleeping is important and allows you, okay. Oh, to save progression. Sick. Well rested. The game auto saves when you whenever you fast travel. 
a rock up close to a signpost or a stable master. Oh, sick. All right, let's go back and sleep. I kind of like, I love, the kind of like that I um, don't have to read everything and they're just kind of talking. It kind of gets you more into the story when you're not just hearing my voice all the time. Damn, I can't wait to explore. Have you already managed to get some rest? Good friend, it'll never cease to amaze me how little sleep you need. This can't be healthy. It's good for you, as long as you have water instead of wine, good friar. I'm not swayed by this. Besides, those who sleep don't sin. I'll keep my wine. <laughs> I knew how you'd react. Take it easy, Tuck. Your cask supply is safe. I should think so. It's a strategic reserve for a time of crisis. Certainly. Not another word. I take it you slept so well you misplaced your weapon. Where is your bow? This time I didn't lose anything. I broke it during the hunt. We've had so much work with building a new village that I haven't had time to craft a new one yet. The forest hasn't been kind to us of late. The worst is behind us, however. And now you can take to making your bow in peace. Grab a hatchet and fell a few trees. The wood should suffice for both the bow and the arrows. I have a hemp cord here that should do as a bowstring. That's all the help I need. Thank you, Tuck. I know how much you value your weapon. See to crafting it, but be right back. Our village needs your help. All right, so go cut some pine trees. Um, where's my axe? I'll put throw it right there. All right, let's go. So I just go. I could go pretty much go anywhere. Let's go this way. This place looks it, dude. Can I use this axe as a fighting thing? That would be sick. Oh, there it is. I was all like, man, I'm gonna chop down this big. Man, imagine raiders coming down these things. That'd be sick. All right, let's cut this. Uh, mining raw materials is a tough job, but you can speed up and improve your work. All you need to do with m when mining is strike the right moment. Okay, cool. I like when they do that. Durability. When a tool breaks, usually that just means you have to make a new one. Repair tools. Every tool you use has a sharpness level. Turns the value type of resource you can extract from the environment. Okay. Okay, I click right when he hits it. Okay, I got it. 11. Because if I hit it before, it won't do it. Okay, that's pretty cool. I kind of like that we could kind of wander out. And then we could also get attacked. It looks like. Or we could go out and do side quests and side missions. It's not just putting us kind of like on a linear path. We could just kind of go off and explore. And I love doing that. Dang, the lighting in this game is amazing. I thought I heard something. You guys hear that? I thought I heard something. I don't know what I'm hearing. Crafting and character development. Owing to Robin's um, crafting skills, you'll have an easier time creating some basic equipment. Select the items that interest you in your inventory. Choose the amount and click craft. Uh, items that you need more specialized equipment, such as swords, will require you to return to the village and you should use specially designed buildings. Uh, learning new skills or improving the ones already known requires experience. You can gain it in many ways, fighting enemies, completing quests, extracting resources, hunting, gathering, and construction. Skill points can be used to develop the skills tree or spent developing. Knowledge is power. Did I grab 15? I did grab 15. So can I craft the bow? Journal. Oh, Jesus, this is insane. Oh, I don't know which one I want to pick yet. Oh, I have six points available. Um, bears, a uh, critical chance. Hunter vision. Max health. Strong pack. I'm going to go this one. Let's pick that one. Um... 
What is this? I feel like I'm gonna use my bow a lot. Bow where? Slow motion duration. Oh my god, that's gonna be sick. Um, let's apply that right now. I'll go look at. Oh, here's the map. Oh wow. That's a huge map. I wonder if this is when the full game is, and this is kind of the demo. Because if this is the demo, this is a lot to check out. That's pretty sick. Um, where was the crafting? Oh, right here is the crafting. Uh, requires pine and a bowstring, which I have. Let's do this. Right, we'll put this there. Put my bow there. Um, it does five. Okay. Sweet. Let's go back and talk to Tuck. Actually, let me try my bow real fast. Not enough arrows in quiver. Wait. Was there a quiver slot? Oh, there it is. There we go. Okay. I wonder if I can get it back. Let me see if I can grab it back. I can. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, let's pick this up. We might need it. Alright, let's head back. Can I climb? I wonder if I could. Oh, let's go over here to this rock real fast before we go back to Tuck. I want to check this out. Oh my god, I wonder if I could... Look at this! This is beautiful, man. I'm going to get sidetracked so easily exploring this world. Let's hope we don't fall off anything. What's that over there? Let's go back to Friar Tuck. With a bow like this, you have nothing to fear. Unless you get on Marion's bad side again by telling her to cook for you, even the purest steel and holy water wouldn't help you then. Time's long past. We've explained things to each other and agreed I wouldn't make this mistake again. <laughs> Be at ease. This time, no one lured her into a trap. She left. That sounds like her. You said you could use my help here? You guys can go ahead and pause if you want to read. Yes, there are many things we need. Food, moat, a better archer couldn't be found in all of Sherwood. Before you set off to take from the rich, perhaps you... I'll gladly try out the new bow. Stoke the fire. Everyone in the village is working so... Alright, one way of securing food is through hunting. Luckily, there's no shortage of game in the local woods. Hunter skillful eye. Does alert... Oi. The... Does oh does also does does are alert cre careful creatures sometimes they're tricky quarry. All right, to use the bow which I've already learned. Uh, senses are, dude. So we're gonna use all the senses right now. All right, let's go hunt some. Twenty five doe meat. Dude, look at this weather. Okay, let's go look. Can I put my? Can I put a point? How do I put a point? Oh, right here. There you go. <gasps> Shoot! What are the odds that that thing was just sitting right there? What are the odds it was just right around the corner? What's going on over there? Oh, here it is. Nice. Pick that up. Oh, give me five. Where'd the other one go? get through these. Are those bandits over there? Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Got him. Oh, dude, look at that slide. Oh, shoot. 
Oh, the kill cam too. Oh hell yeah, that was sick. Blew him up. Alright, deliver the meat to the warehouse. I want to see who these guys are over here real fast. Let's see what we can do. If we could sneak in here. Oh yeah, those are bad guys for sure. Man, this guy's ready. Uh, special attack is... Oh, dude, he parried out of the way. Oh, nice. Oh. Heck yeah. Sack of coins. Cheese. What does the other guy have? I gotta get ready for these. Coins. This is a cool little bandit cap. Oh, dude, they killed somebody. Is that the guy I killed? I didn't kill that guy. Um, stone. I don't need that. Garlic. Might be able to use that for something. Alright, cool. We'll get better to the attacks. I just wanted to kind of see what different attacks there were. This is, like, I'm going to get so lost in this world. I'm glad that there's more to do. We'll return the meat, and then I'll end the episode there. I just wanted to jump in real fast and make a quick little intro episode. See if there was a lot to explore, which there is. Where's the meat? There we go. Saints and heavens above, you back safe and sound, good Robin. How long have we known each other that you still need to ask? <laughs> My eyes haven't failed me this time either. By the blessed mother. Hmm. What do you mean by that? The expansion of our settlement, of course. The merry men. I think I know. Have I become that predictable? Hmm. All right, so we're going to start building something. But let me know what you guys think. If you're not subscribed already, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Let's run up here real fast. And oh! <laughs> oh, he caught, he caught himself. Oh, man, he's Assassin's Creed. Let's get up here first. We'll end it up there. I want to see what's up there real fast. Then we'll end off the episode. Let's get over here. Man, if I could build one of these. What is this? Oh. Well, that's it. They just had the antlers up there. Alright. Well, anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comments section. Let me know if you want to see more of it. Like I said, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Look, it's raining again. <laughs>